one of my buddies decided to join. And I was kind of at a point where I was working a job after high school, didn't really have plans to go to college, and decided just, what the heck? Germany, the Netherlands, Ireland, London, Spain, France, Italy, Greece, Turkey, Belgium, Czech Republic, Al Udeed, Africa, Iraq. Saw a lot of places. After everywhere I've been, I can say that America is the greatest country in the world. But as Americans, we really should like slow down and take the time to appreciate the small things that we take advantage of every single day. Military, I didn't necessarily love my job, but I loved serving and wanted to get into something else. But for me, it was, do I grind this out for the next 12 years and wait on a pension and retirement? Or do I spend the next 12 years actually pursuing a passion and enjoying what I'm doing day in, day out? Basically, after I got out, I got to grow my hair out. I didn't have to worry about a haircut every two weeks. I actually got to grow out my mustache more, and now it actually looks like a mustache. And essentially just be kind of a trout bone. <laughs> I ended up back in my home state of Oregon, and outside of putting meals on the table and worrying about bills and stuff like that, I just spent pretty much every waking moment chasing fish. Like, before I go to bed, I'm sitting there thinking about fish. When I wake up, I'm thinking about fish. Like, my wife, she wouldn't want to hear that, but <laughs> that's the reality of it. It's just, it's a passion that really just consumes me. What's the next step? So for me, in fly fishing, it was, can I put other people on the same fish that I'm experiencing and figuring out the same passion that I have. It's a beautiful thought to think that I can open the door for them to shed a little light on what I love to do. I think that, to me, is the most intriguing thing about becoming a guide. I don't know that I necessarily made a difference in the time that I served, but we as a people definitely take advantage of our passions and just being able to go out and enjoy them. And I'm definitely not gonna be one of those people. I'm just gonna do anything that I can to be happy, and whether that's grabbing my dog in a fly rod and head to the river or going out with my wife on a hike and just being able to get outside and enjoy all the the rad shit we get to see day in, day out here in America. That's really, at this point in my life, all that's important to me.